try to uh, improve uh, political and uh, economic power uh, of blacks. So what does it mean? So they are interconnected. Political power may lead to the increasing um, African Americans is, uh, of course, less, uh, much less. It's uh, 28,000. Uh, and the whites' income, uh, annual income, is uh, 44,000. Um, so this is a um, very um, a big gap. Uh, and uh, they also uh, are lagging behind in education. Uh, but um, the poverty and unemployment is connected what? What, what do you think is connected with what? Uh, why, why the gap is so big? Because lower education. Uh, alternatives for jobs uh, or education, first of all education. Uh, even um, women in, um, in the United States were not given opportunity to get education. Uh, and uh, so Without education, they understand quite well that it's impossible to get jobs. normal jobs. So this is the reason why they stay longer in high schools. Yeah, so the percentage is much higher if we compare with 1960s. It was about 20% and now it's 75%. Um, and uh, they enter colleges, the enrollment rate is very high. Uh, also, and, uh, this um, gives us the impression that they understand well that uh, education is, uh, is the tool uh, for them uh, to, to open uh, doors in different fields. So, um, this is um, the problem uh, at the moment that, that is being improved. And what is uh, political um, condition or political state of African Americans. So uh, they, they occupy rather um, high positions in but government today. Why? Because they were given uh, voting right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. So more blacks vote and more blacks are elected. So this is the case. So we see uh, blacks uh, uh, in, uh, in Congress. Out of blacks in Congress. Also, they uh, started entering uh, professional jobs. Yeah. So, uh, well, they, yes. yes, they. There are a lot of teachers, lawyers, uh, okay. judges, judges, ministers. Yeah. ministers. Yeah. Yes, and they enter business. Yeah. So there are uh, more than six hundred thousand uh, businesses owned by blacks. Mm -hmm. So uh, this is the case, and um, still there is some. Uh, um, <coughs> racial, uh, uh, negative racial experience. Uh, uh, yes, that, uh, that, is, uh, that is fact still in this society. Yes. Um, so, what, uh, what do you think uh, uh, happened? What do you think happened when they were segregated? Yes. Uh, so many blacks understood their conditions, and they, some of them developed it like uh, it happened uh, during the bus boycott in Montgomery, 1955, uh, when uh, one of the women, uh, Rosa Parks, didn't let uh, one person to give her. Uh, what was the name of this woman? Rosa, Rosa, Rosa Parks. Park. Rosa, Rosa, Rosa Parks. Park. And she uh, didn't uh, give her seat. Uh, he didn't give her seat to the white. Uh, now we we also have. Uh, Famous people um, uh, who have written very interesting Cooks. books. Yes, writers. Uh, so James Baldwin. Yes. So we have uh, Alice Richards. Uh, yes, Walker. Walker. Very famous uh, African Americans. Very interesting person. Ben Carson. Uh, he is a physician, a yeah. uh, surgeon, and he has invented new methods method. of separating co-joint yeah. twins. So this is a very difficult operation, you know, and um, we have seen a lot of cases on TV of separating yeah. co-joint twins. Now, who are these um, outstanding yeah. yeah. yes. yeah. uh, black congresswomen? First, black congresswomen. You know that uh, Women's rights were violated mm -hmm. 
So um, it didn't happen until 1992 that uh, an African American woman was uh, uh, became was elected uh, in Congress. Yes, and she be, uh, she was from South, deep South. Yes, and who is another uh, African American person? Justice. Clarence Thomas, and he has been on the U.S. Supreme, Supreme Court. Of course, Supreme Court is the highest. The high court in the so they are very famous. Now, um, outstanding African Americans. Uh, on the slide, uh, the first one is Jesse yes, Jackson. Times for president. Yes, he was running for president um, two times, and he was a very energetic and uh, motivating uh, like, Charismatic. Yes, charismatic. Who is the Colin Powell? Powell. First African American chosen to be Secretary of State. Why right. is not black? Um, he's not very dark. He's black. 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 Yeah. black. I saw him. He was white and not black. No, no. I saw him. Uh, you will see yeah. my picture with him. He is not white. It cuts on the but, but you know, among I'm blacks, you, you uh, see that some of them are very dark, dark. others yes. are not so dark. So, um, uh, so there is a stereotyping about black leaders that they cannot uh, uh, articulate well. They are not intelligent and uh, well educated. That they cannot be. Of course. Uh, um, it is not so. A, a lot of examples we have uh, who have uh, uh, shown us that they are very articulate, intelligent, motivated, um, and competent. Uh, now, who were these um, leaders? For example, Booker, Washington. Yeah. But, and they have uh, generally focused on community, uh, generally society. So uh, they were leading masses. Now, what was uh, Booker Washington focusing on? Uh, he was. It was his um, major issue yes, for fighting. Yeah. Now, uh, another one was when Du Bois. Du Bois. Du Bois. Uh, it's a French. Uh, I think it's a, some people pronounce it Du Bois, but uh, like uh, in France. Can be pronounced, but generally it's Du Bois. Yes. So he uh, he concentrated on political and to paid attention to education. Education. Uh, now Marcus Garvey, um, he was rather a militant person, and he focused on militant activation. And actually, um, through his experience, blacks. Uh, 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 adopted uh, segregation uh, methodology, mm -hmm. so to say. Now, who was Malcolm X? Uh, he was uh, radical, radical, but also great leader. And at last, we can talk about uh, Martin Luther King. He was the greatest. He turned out to be the greatest and the most purposeful. 